Greetings, travelers, and welcome to another episode of Let's Play Xenoblade Chronicles X, presented by Draco Breach. Last time I left you with a bit of a cliffhanger. I apologize. This time we are heading into what is probably a fairly lengthy cutscene. So let's get going. That is rather large. No signs of any radiation. Infrared, motion sensors, I got nothing. This thing's dead as a doornail. Oh man! So it's basically a scale, right? But the make is nothing like ours. Or the Ganglions. Where could it be from? Oh, wow. I can't even tell what its armor is made of. What is this feeling? Definitely reminded me of Zohar's. It's oppressive. It's pulsing off of this thing. It's almost as if the ghost of its pilot is somehow still lingering. That material there, at its core, it's dark matter. This must be their handiwork. Elma knows something. Hmm? Oh, sorry. I'm fine. Just thinking. All right. Well, we got what we came here for. Let's call in the salvage choppers and get it out of here. Lynn, contact Commander Vandom. On it. Okay, this can... Right. We should start heading back, too. Mm, just thinking about walking past all those tainted again makes my knees all wobbly. Tatsu have just the thing! Um... Friends fuel up with Tatsu Tasty Lunchbox! <laughs> Tatsu, you idiot. Tatsu? What are you doing here? Tatsu knew friends must be hungry, so Tatsu rides spinning plane here to deliver hot meal. Tatsu hero pod, after all. Ugh, you idiots! You're gonna attract the tainted! Relax, Lindley. After quick lunch, Tatsu fly back home on spinning plane before anyone notice. And how exactly do you plan to do that? All the spinny planes have already left. You're gonna have to walk back through all those tainted! Last ten seconds out here. Maybe we can get another chocolate here in time. Nope. Too late. Oh dear, Tatsu. Somebody else wants a hot Tatsu, don't move an inch, you hear? Okay. <laughs> this could be an interesting problem. Let's hope not. Um, first concentrate fire. Then... Oh, they're not nearly as high leveled as the other ones. Oh, come on. That didn't last long enough for me to do anything with it. We're going to stay with our guns for just a moment. Because it builds up TP nice and quickly. And I want... Oh well, that didn't work as well as I had hoped. 
Um, can't right now. That'll unlock hopefully in time. Um, I was toppled. That's not good. What am I... Oh, I love it when I hit buttons that I don't mean to. Let's see if we can get him toppled. I, yeah, my D. <laughs> yes. That worked well. Tatsu, your dinner tonight. <laughs> oh, jeez. Um. Um. Oh, look. It's a behemoth. Um, I wish I had a healer right now. Take him down. I really wish I had Irina or Doug <laughs> instead of Lau, because this is going to be a, um... Come on, oh man. Wow, that did not activate in time. I'd rather stick to this, Lau. I'm sorry. Rats. Uh, oh. Uh, wonderful. Concentrate fire. Um, what am I concentrating on? Slash. Eh, may as well. Because that sounds dangerous. Okay. Rats, he did not get toppled. Okay. Some crazy tactics right now that I hope end up working. Oh, I took out his... Okay. Um... Please, rats. Resistant but not immune. So, rats, rats, lows out. Um, um, that was a long stagger. I'm in trouble. Uh, medic free. <laughs> um, this is good. Um Okay, this is this is this is awesome. Um I'm about to go down. Oh, lovely. Um Um Yeah. That went well. I hate you right now. Where am I? And there's not a fast travel. Lovely. Um. Oh, Tatsu. Well, let's try this again and hope that we get less fail. Thank you, Tatsu. Oh, man. Okay. Oh, 
Okay. That opening overdrive helped. Well, that's good. Well, we're in better condition, kinda. He's resistant, but not immune to that, but it's very hard to get him to topple. Uh... Oh, that's good. Um... Lovely. Rats, rats. Uh, my aura is still up. That's good. Um. What? I guess I was okay. Oh come on. Okay. Not what I meant to hit. Rats, 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 rats. Let's see if I can... Not. Failure. Oh, we took it down. Oh, twice is a charm, I suppose. Well, that was fun. Let's get the hell out of here. Yeah, I agree with Lau. Please, no more. Yeah, some alpha. There's multiples. You got to be kidding me. What the hell is that? It's a phoenix. No, seriously, it looks like a phoenix. Hey, there's no fall damage in this game. You're breaking the... Never mind. You can break the rules. Go right ahead. And I am getting Telethia vibes. I am getting definite Telethia vibes. Yeah, attack it. That's smart. Tail whip, it's super effective. Oh wow, I'm making too many references, I'm sorry. Earthquake. It missed. Um Seismic Toss. Wow, I called it. And dinner time. Yep. Well, here's the thing that we've learned. Tainted do not eat other tainted. Ugh. So, that Telethia-like creature is not tainted. Not yummy, we don't have any flavor. Go away. Okay, Gust. I need to stop with the Pokemon references. Hey, like a Pokemon, it only knew four moves. Sorry, I apologize for nothing. 
Oh, wow. Was that thing trying to help us? Maybe. Or maybe it was just toying with us. Well, I think I could have taken it. <laughs> uh, yeah. Mm-hmm. We should get back to New L.A. I want to stop by the hangar and get a better look at that scout. Right. I vote Tatsu for dinner. <laughs> oh man. This strong when I needed to be. Okay, interesting stuff. Oh, uh, yeah, take all. So, um, at this point, we should be able to simply travel back to NLA. So I think I'm going to do exactly that because. Um, I think that was intense enough for one cutscene. Restricted hangar. I don't. Oh, 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 oh. Yes, I do remember that place. It's on the lower level of the administrative district. Was it locked off before? Yes, it was. And now it should be unlocked. I hope. Good work, people. Commander? What are you doing out here? Did they seal off the area? Actually, I was waiting for you, Lynn. Hmm? Why me? You want to tinker with that new alien mech? Well, I mean, duh. Good, because I'm putting you in charge of research. Hip hip hurrah. You reel it in, you get first crack at it. You and your team risked a lot out there. You earned it. R really, sir? Everything's set up. They're expecting you. Yes, sir. Oh my god, thank you so much, Commander. Lin Lee is excited. Oh yeah, that was intense enough for one chapter end. Oh. Or components for the purple frame heart. In fact, I can't even find a power source. Maybe it's like an idol or something? To some alien god or whatever? What about a cockpit? Or any space for a pilot? Let's see here. There is a cavity in the middle of the chest area. If this thing is a vehicle, that'd have to be the cockpit. Hmm. Perhaps it's not a weapon? It was abandoned, after all, and in that godforsaken place. But it was also worth the gangly and sacrificing all those soldiers to try and recover it. Surely it must hold some value. Granted. Now the question is whether we'll be able to uncover it. Ms. Gu is one of our best, but we can't expect her to work miracles. If you ask me, that's time better spent studying that Ares of yours, Elma. All right, you wouldn't know what I'm talking about, would you? Let me explain. The Ares is what Elma abandoned. Oh, right. And Lau is suspicious of something. Alma knows something. Those are your orders. Have I made myself clear? Quiet. You seem displeased, Gajar. 
Perhaps the great hero of Roth does not enjoy taking orders from the gang. Perhaps he feels it beneath him. It appears nothing is beneath me of late. They don't like each other. Hmm. I still hear the anger in your voice, the way you spit out the words. Accept your fate. Then you might find me a more accommodating master, Prince John. Oh, but how rude of me. Should I have said former prince? Okay, the plot thickens. I never cared much for titles, council, and luxor. It's Grand Master, damn you! The entire Ganglion organization is at my command, as are you and your people. I will not remind you again. Oh, but how rude of me. My sincere apologies, Grand Counselor. Hmm. Have you also forgotten the price the Rothian people will pay if you fail me? I promise you, it will not be pretty. What will happen if the humans beat you to the prize? Need I remind you of that as well? No, you need not. Then mind your tongue, former prince. Unless your pride can feed and clothe your people. Filthy cur. Yet I will suffer him gladly, if he can help lead me to you, O oh, Great One. Have I mentioned my distaste for the ganglion? Another storage probe. That actually could come in handy. Ah, scale license. Nice. If that is a chapter, I am going to probably hold off on that for the time being. Um, okay, hello. I think I've talked to these people. <laughs> I know where it is, so I can come back here later. But, uh, yeah. <laughs> the Ganglion are definitely uh, using their power to... Oh, there's a quest over here. Um, let me pick that up. from a mana, manan. Okay. <laughs> okay, this is a gathering quest, so unfortunately this will take a long time to do, but oh well, it's in my quest log to help that person. Um, regardless, as I was saying, they, um, the Ganglion, so far as we know, have threatened the Prone into obeying them, attempted to threaten the Manon into, into, um, joining them, and have successfully threatened 
the newest race that we were introduced to that I can't remember the name of because I am that bad with names uh, into helping. Um, so the Ganglion are very oppressive and very, very cruel. So we know that. Um, however, for the time being, this is going to be Draco Breach reporting out. God bless and safe travels.